Today we're working on 2001 BMW 325i or CI 2.5 liter engine. What we have is cold start. It fires on all cylinders and also link codes. So we're gonna see upon putting on the smoke, find out that the uh, throttle body, throttle body hose is, has a big leak on the bottom, so it's ripped off. So we're gonna repair that and hopefully that will care take care of the problem so if you have something similar to this uh, check for a uh, broken throttle body hose right we are trying to find out more leaks on this vehicle since uh, the first leak was uh, not what it wasn't actually a uh, broken hose of the throttle body but it was that the hose wasn't pushed in all the way you can see where the clamp was clamping over here it went on the side here and then went out so it wasn't all the way in clamping on the bottom of the uh, at the bottom side of the uh, throttle body so probably that happens when someone comes over and check the the uh, air filter stuff like that but we still have some uh, some vacuum problems there's uh, one up here that I have found and there's another one down over there on that. Uh, it's gonna be hard to see, but it's, let's see if I can point it out. There's a plug on the back over there, right where my flashlight is at. Let's see if I can focus from here. gonna be hard but it's it's right here I'm pointing to it that right there that's a plug that's a uh, boot plug rubber boot and that one is broken as well we're gonna verify that with the smoker but we have one here on the on the front as well so it's big leak That's uh, let's see if I can focus here. Let's see if we get it through here. It's down there, but it's gonna be hard for you guys to see it. But it's actually down there. It's a hose. It's a broken hose over there, where my uh, fingers at. It's kind of hard to see it. We're gonna replace that and see if we can find it, find any more uh, leaks. Right, I have managed to uh, get the hose, uh, broken hose that was on the bottom. There it is. It was broken. This one connects to the uh, oil dipstick tube. There's a connect on the bottom the where it hooks to it and this one on the top side it connects to the CCV or PCV valve uh, system get it down way down there this piece goes under it over there it's under the intake and it goes in what you have to do is press on the tabs side tabs and pull down from it I'm just gonna replace that some people have to replace all the system I'm gonna replace this and see if I can get uh, results I'm gonna put more smoke and see if I can find any more leaks uh, but there's the plug back over there on the side of the uh, intake so this is the plug it also gets gets a burrito and breaks towards apart and it starts leaking so this one was also leaking allowing air to get into the system all right so after i have already replaced that hose that goes from the from the uh, pcv system on the bottom of that uh, ccv i think it's called and it goes to the uh, depth stick dipstick the tube and also have plugged the plug on the back of the um, intake and there's no apparently there's no more leaks in there so i'm gonna turn on the smoker again 
and wait for more for smoke to come out. I believe there was an, a smoke coming from the bottom and I have already taken two bolts from my plate. I'm gonna show you guys. It's down here. There's a, there's a plate here and this I took them I took the two bolts and there's a, a vacuum leak right there that's a broken hose as well and there is throwing a lot of smoke so we're gonna have to fix that that one as well so there you have it we're still working on this system that is leaking has a lot of uh, vacuum leaks so we're going to stop at that and we're going to fix that and see if we have any more leaks. Right here we are again. Now we have another leak here on the top. Right here in this joint. It goes to the uh, brake booster. I have already fixed the one at the bottom under the chassis. So now we have another one here. We're going to fix that as well. And see if we can... Uh, Get rid of all these uh, vacuum hole uh, problems. Right, we have fixed that leak right there. It was on the connector, this hose over here. And then there was another leak on this big hose that goes over here on the top. Uh, really small leak, so I just go and I just uh, tied it, tied that, um, tied that up a little bit more, so it won't uh, leak. So so far, I have found six leaks on this vehicle, and I believe uh, I believe I'm not finished, but I believe it's going to create a big improvement, big improvement on the. Uh, misfires that this vehicle had so if you're having trouble like that check all the uh, all the parts that I show you all the, the locations for uh, torn or missing uh, hoses good luck with your repair guys so I have repaired the, the uh, vacuum uh, leaks the victim is running Smooth. There's no more shaking, no rough, no more rough idle. And the only thing that I have to replace is the uh, perch the valve, the perch valve that goes right there. That's the only one that I have to replace. But that one's faulty, and the only code that I have is that for the uh, for that valve, perch valve. Q0444, but before had many many codes so there you have it guys hope this one helps someone out there and give a thumbs up